We're given a vector valued function and we're asked to find the second derivative. So all we have to do is take the derivative twice. So r prime of t, we'll just differentiate each of the components. So the derivative of sine is cosine, so we get 6 cosine t i. And the derivative of cosine is negative sine, so this is negative 8 sine t j. And here we can use the power rule. We'll bring the 4 downstairs, so we get plus 4 t cubed k. We're ready to take the second derivative. So the second derivative, the derivative of cosine is negative sine, so this is negative 6 sine t i. The derivative of sine is cosine, so this is negative 8 cosine t j. And here we can use the power rule, so 3 times 4 is 12. And we subtract 1 from the 3, so we get t squared k. And that's the second derivative of our vector-valued function. This was a pretty easy example.